A recently discovered comet will soon make an appearance in the night sky for the first time in 50,000 years. Discovered on March 2, 2022 by astronomers using the Zwicky Transient Facilities Wide Field Survey Camera at the Palomar Observatory in San Diego County, California, the comet will make its closest approach to the Sun on January 12, according to NASA. Hello and welcome to KYC News. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon. Named C-2022 E3 ZTF, the comet has an orbit around the Sun that passes through the outer reaches of the solar system, which is why it's taken such a long journey, and long time, to swing by Earth again, according to the Planetary Society. Skygazers in the Northern Hemisphere using telescopes and binoculars should look low on the northeastern horizon just before midnight to spot it on January 12th, according to EarthSky. The icy celestial object, which has steadily brightened as it approaches the Sun, will subsequently make its closest pass of Earth between February 1st and February 2nd, around 26 million miles, 42 million kilometers, away, according to EarthSky, as the comet nears Earth. Observers will be able to spot it near the bright star Polaris, also called the North Star, and it should be visible earlier in the evening. The comet should be visible through binoculars in the morning sky for sky watchers in the Northern Hemisphere during most of January and those in the Southern Hemisphere in early February, according to NASA. Depending on how bright it becomes in the coming weeks, C-2022 E3 ZTF may even become visible to the unaided eye in dark skies toward the end of January. The comet can be distinguished from stars by its streaking tails of dust and energized particles, as well as the glowing green coma surrounding it. The coma is an envelope that forms around a comet as it passes close to the sun, causing its ice to sublimate or turn directly to gas. This causes the comet to look fuzzy when observed through telescopes. And don't miss the other celestial events to see in 2023. A rare incident is all set to take place as a bright icy green comet is expected to come near Earth's outer space for the very first time in 50,000 years. As per one of the NASA officials, the green comet was spotted initially in March 2022, inside Jupiter's orbit. According to scientists, the bright green comet is expected to come near Earth and would be easily spotted on February 2, 2023. As per a NASA blog, comets are infamously unpredictable. However, one can spot them if one carries on the comet's current trend in brightness. Interestingly, the blog also said that possibly, the comet would be visible to the naked eye or simply with binoculars under dark skies from January 12th. The comet C-2022 E3 ZTF is now heading toward the inner solar system, getting brighter. On January 12th, 2023, it will reach perihelion, or come closest to the sun, at a distance of one Australian dollar and 11 cents. The comet's magnitude will equal about 6.5. According to NASA, C-2022 E3 ZTF is the scientific name of the Green Comet. The comet would make its nearest approach to the sun on Thursday. Later, it will move toward Earth on the second day of February. Here, the comet will be only around 42 million kilometers away from Earth. No wonder this event is regarded as a great chance as it will only happen once in a lifetime. Why is it so? Well, this is because a comet requires approximately 50,000 years to orbit the Sun. What are comets composed of? Comets are actually dirty ice balls. They are composed of several compounds. These include mineral grains, carbon dioxide, and dry ice. Almost all comets are composed of two tails. One of these is the ion tail. This tail is yellowish in color. On the other hand, the other one is a dust tail. This one is bluish in color. It is important to note that comet tails are always pointed away from the sun. 
A comet from the outer solar system is set to swing through our cosmic neighborhood this month for the first time in 50,000 years, offering sky watchers a glimpse of this celestial object as it nears Earth and the Sun in a once-in-a-lifetime occurrence. The comet, officially known as C-2022E3 ZTF, will make its closest approach to the Sun on Thursday and could be bright enough to be seen through telescopes and binoculars. Comets can be tricky to spot in the night sky, but this cosmic interloper has been steadily brightening as it moves through the inner solar system, which should help people catch a glimpse, according to NASA. Astronomers have been tracking the comet as it approaches, but amateur sky watchers may have a good chance to see the comet in the early morning sky on Thursday, sometime after midnight but before dawn. People in the Northern Hemisphere should stake out a spot looking toward the northeastern sky and gaze low on the horizon, according to EarthSky, a website devoted to sky watching and astronomy. With binoculars, the comet may appear as a faint green glow in the sky moving northwest. Telescopes will likely be able to spy finer details of the green comet, possibly including part of its faint tail. Skywatchers will have chances to glimpse the comet through most of the remainder of the month. The icy object will then make its closest approach to Earth on February 2nd, NASA officials said. At that point, the comet will come within about 26 million miles of the planet, according to the Planetary Society. If the comet continues brightening, it may be possible to see it with the naked eye as it makes its closest approach to Earth in early February. After that, the next opportunity to see Comet C-2022E3 ZTF won't come around for a long, long time. This icy body has a long orbit that takes it on a journey around the Sun and far into the outer solar system over thousands of years. Comet C-2022E3 ZTF was discovered last March by astronomers using the Zwicky Transient Facility's Wide Field Survey Camera at the Palomar Observatory, north of San Diego. A green comet discovered last March will make its closest approach to Earth this month. The comet C-2022E3 ZTF was first discovered by astronomers using the Wide Field Survey Camera at California's Zwicky Transient Facility. It was already inside the orbiter of Jupiter. Since then, it has brightened substantially and is sweeping across the northern constellation Corona Borealis in pre-dawn skies, according to NASA. NASA notes that the brightness of comets is unpredictable, but that, by then, C-2022E3 ZTF could become only just visible to the eye in night skies. Observers in the Northern Hemisphere will find the comet in the morning sky as it moves swiftly toward the Northwest during January. It'll become visible in the Southern Hemisphere in early February, it said. This comet isn't expected to be quite as much of a spectacle as Comet Neowise was in 2020. NASA officials said the icy visitor was first spotted in March 2022 while it was inside the orbit of Jupiter. It could be seen through binoculars as a small green glow to those in the Northern Hemisphere starting on Thursday. It will be closest to Earth on February 2nd, scientists said. Comets are notoriously unpredictable, but if this one continues its current trend in brightness, it'll be easy to spot, NASA said on its blog earlier this month. It's just possible it could become visible to the unaided eye under dark skies. The icy celestial body called C-2022E3 ZTF, a mouthful of a name, according to NASA, is making its closest approach to the Sun on January 12th before making its closest approach to Earth on February 2nd. At that point it will be just about 26 million miles, 42 million kilometers, away from the planet, according to the Planetary Society. The fireball's official name is Comet C-2022E3 ZTF, and it will be visible January 12th with binoculars and perhaps even to the naked eye, NASA announced last month. The comet was first discovered by astronomers last March, and since then it has brightened substantially and its layered tails have become more visible, NASA said. 
The comet will be its closest to the sun on January 12th, and, if its trend of brightening continues, it could become more visible to the eye under dark night skies, NASA said.